All right, today we're going to talk about a problem that comes up when you move from one domain to another sometimes. WordPress stores a lot of links and links to images in the database using what's called absolute links, which means that it includes the domain name in the code when, wherever it saves it. So what happens when you go from one domain to another, links and images continue to point towards the old domain. And you can see that here on this site that I've just moved from a temporary URL that I was using, galliottis.epicdesignlabs.com, to Galliottis Wine Cellar. And when I inspect this image, you'll see that the link here in the code says galliottis.epicdesignlabs.com. So it is still resolving, and that's only because I have this picture basically cached in my in my browser. So if I open this up from another computer, this is probably going to be a broken image as well. There's some links down here on the page like this right here. You can see that links to galliottis.epicdesignlabs.com. So what you need to do um, is basically update these URLs to say the new URL in the code. So there's a couple ways that you can do that. You can go through pages manually, which is going to take forever. You can use a crawling program like a Screaming Frog SEO Spider to crawl it and look for external links that point to the old domain. You can see there's a bunch that came up. Now, if this was a larger site, this would be a huge problem because imagine if I had 200 pages in my blog and I needed to update all of them to a new URL. You know, that's going to take all year to do manually. So it would be it would be way easier to use this if there's a plugin that can just update all these at once. Now to install a plugin, what we're going to do is we're going to go to plugins, click add new, and type in update URLs. This is what we're looking for, Velvet Blues update URLs. So go ahead and click install now. Then on the next screen, go ahead and activate the plugin. Now the way to use this plugin is really easy. You're going to find the admin panel for it under tools, update URLs. And it's really simple. You have this field here for old URL and a field here for new URL. And so what we're going to do is we're going to go back and we're going to copy the link here that has the old URL in it. And we're going to paste that in here. Now we don't want anything that comes after the .com or whatever uh, top level domain you're on. So .com, .org, .net, whatever. So we just want the root domain in here that it used to be. And then we're going to put the root domain that it's at now. Now I don't want this slash at the end on either the old URL or the top or the new URL. So everything from the HTTP to the end of the .com is what I'm going to put in here. And this is going to update everything that has this old URL in it to this URL. Go ahead and click update URLs in page content and excerpts and links and attachments and custom fields. You can leave this blank. It says right here that it's only for uh, development sites. And all you have to do is click update URLs now. And it says, sorry, and it says success. Your URLs have been updated. So let's go back to the site and just verify that's true. I'm going to click F5 to refresh it. And then if I look here in the code at that exact same link, it says galliottiswinecellar.com slash the club. So it's updated that. Let's look at the image. You can see in the image that it's been updated to galliottiswinecellar.com as well. So this is no longer a broken link. And basically all of the URLs that pointed to anything on the old domain are now have now been redirected to point to the same exact things but on the new domain and that's how you use the velvet blues update urls plugin once you're done with it uh, this is really something that you only need as a one-time fix so you can go ahead and uninstall it just to keep your plugins clean it's always a good idea to just uninstall and delete uh, any plugins that you're not continuing to use but you know if you've moved from one domain to another this is pretty much exactly what you need to fix uh, all the all the URL problems that come up with that and as you can see it's quick and easy and makes you look like a genius thanks a lot and uh, be sure to follow us on Facebook thanks thanks for watching if you like this video go ahead and click like and then click the link below to sign up for our newsletter where we'll send you guides reviews and how to's directly to you as well as our free guide on how to make money with your WordPress site